My name is Willie. I'm a member of Skidmark Garage for like three years coming on now. I grew up not far from here, Skidmark Garage on 71st and St. Clair and Superior area. Oh, I changed a lot. Where we at right now, Skidmark used to be a factory with a lot of blue collar guys. All of these areas, factory workers, you know? Blue collar people living regular lives. A lot of them moved out, you know, because the place was going through a transition. But uh, it's not changed. it hasn't changed a, to a whole lot, but it has changed. Especially in this area, because like I said, there's a lot of jobs and a lot of people living in all of these neighborhoods. That they kind of thinned out, you know, you kind of see more of abandoned houses and fields. One day I was up watching Kick New Kenny, like I say, and I saw him doing an interview with Brian. And it was around the time when my son, I just lost my son to him being murdered on 30th in the projects. I never forget him, Terrence, man, and I love you to death, my son. So I was kind of looking for something to do, and I had a little knowledge of bikes. Ever since then, I've been a member, and I'm like on three or four or five different bikes. I found a community, which I love and appreciate. And it's in between where I come from, 71st and Superior and St. Clair, to 55th. No, I actually didn't have, a, I had no bikes when I joined. And I had bought what we call a basket case where it was all parts. The frame was bent. Ironic about that story is when I came to Brian, I told him what I was trying to do. I wanted to build a Harley Davidson bagger. It was a 2007 Road Glide. Orange and black, sweet. But it was, like I said, it was a pile of parts. He said, well, when you find the frame, we'll start working on it. The frame I found was bent. So I came to Brian, didn't know what I was gonna do. Brian went and got Johnny Reinhardt. Him and Johnny Reinhardt put screws in the floor so we can use the crane to bend the frame out. 